Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm wondering with a turtle wax trim restore, transform door, plastic like new, apply one step for instant results. Now, as y'all can see, my dashboard is all faded like this is on my Honda Passport. See how bad it look here and stuff. I cleaned it, and this is what it looked like if I cleaned it. So I just cleaned it real good. But it's kind of faded looking. All right, so here I'm going to use this Turtle Wax Trim Restore here to try to restore the color back into it. Don't know if it's going to work, but it's worth a try, though. Sometimes you just have to dye this jank. All right, it may not be no hair. I cleaned it with some cleaner, and now the only thing I'm trying to do is restore it back to the color. I didn't know it was going to do that, but it is what it is, though. I feel like this Turtle Wax Trim Restore I actually restore the color back into the dash. But sometimes you can get what you call dyes too. And kind of dye it back. But I don't think you need it. I think turtle wax might do it. Alright, y'all see the before over here. And we're going to see the after results. Alright, let's get it. I don't know what it's going to do now. I'm just guessing and hoping that turtle wax will do the, do the, do the trick. Do his thing. Stop capping, y'all. <laughs> Stop the kids at. Stop capping. <laughs> I just wonder where turtle wax work. Seems like it's gonna do the job. As y'all can see, it's, it's putting the light back into it. That's what I want to do. That's what I want to see. Look at there. Just gotta soap it right in there. Look at there, y'all. It's, it's working. Looks pretty darn good. I'm gonna put some more product. I want it thick. I want it thick as I can get it, cause I want it to really go down in there, you know. Yep, and this is what you need a UV protect your dash. Seriously, I mean, when it's summer heat coming here, you're gonna want to get up on this turtle wax product because stuff like this, man, you're gonna really need it. So, I just kind of pour it thick so it'll kind of just sit there and work down into the material where it's faded. Shit. Look at there, just pour a lot up there and go around your door panels with it like this. Cause like I said, man, when it get hot, that's really where it take the most impact. Look at here. Look how it's black in the door handle, the door panel molding right here. See how much darker it becoming? Look at here. Look at here. This stuff works excellent on the interior. Look at here. Cause like I was about to say, and most times your your dashboard will take the most impact. During the summer months, when it's like 90 and 95 degrees outside, that heat really draw that dash. And that's what starts it to crack. When it draw all the oils out of the dashboard, the next thing you know, when it ain't oiled up and flexible no more, boom, crack open. If it draw back in, let's say it gets 70, 70 at night, 95 daytime, that up, draw back, draw in, draw up, draw in, draw up, boom, next thing you know, it cracks. If you ain't got no oils on it, then next thing you know, you got a cracked up dashboard. I mean, this stuff actually working. You got to let it sit up there. You got to pour a good amount. It's got to sit there and work its magic so it can kind of put the life back into your dash. Look at here. That's why you got to pour a lot of it. Because it's got to sit up there and kind of work down into the material of the dash. See? And what longer it sit, the longer time it get to work. See there? And y'all saw how faded this dashboard was because I just cleaned it. That's all I did was actually cleaned it. And with this sitting here, we can move the ball. And y'all can see the 50 50 difference here. Look at there. Look over there how they haven't touched it compared to this. Oh my God. That looks way, way better, man. Way better. And you got to keep oils on it. I'm telling you guys, you got to keep oils on your dash. It will most definitely crack on you. 
You, know, you gotta keep oils on it, man. Check that out. Oh man, even around the door panels, you can see all around here how good it looks. I'm trying to tell y'all, man, you gotta keep your oils up here. If you don't, that's the same thing for your door panel. You don't keep oils on it, it'll crack. And it'll start busting all up. Y'all know how that works. But man, that looks good. Man, my dash will fade it bad. I'm satisfied now. Like I said, you had to pour a good amount. You can wipe off the excess later, but you're going to want to sit up here mainly overnight, I would say. The reason why, because you want to get all the stuff as possible to your dash. You want to soak down the material to kind of just soak down into the material of the dash. So that protects it from cracking and stuff. See, that's why you want the soap in there. I don't mean just pour it up there and wipe it. You want the stuff to soap up there. Pour the wet amount up here so it'll soak down into the material of the dash. The plastic kind of absorb it. That's the best way to see it. Absorb it. So it can absorb down into the dash. So it put the oils back into it. Turtle wax stuff did an excellent, professional, perfect job here. Look at how I looked at first. Y'all see that? Watch this. Y'all see that? Now that's what I'm talking about. Like I said, don't be, don't be skeptical about using a whole lot. Use a whole lot of this stuff. You got to. Cause you got to put the oil. See here, when I clinked it, see when I clinked it here, all the oils came out of the dash. And this puts it back in the dash. Damn. Alright. So y'all see my results. 50-50 right here. And man, this is what my end results looking like. I don't think nothing could done in no bed and turtle wax. That's all I can say. Hit that subscribe button and that notification, man. You couldn't do it no better, nothing. And nothing you could have bought did it no better than turtle wax. Right here. Till next time. Stay tuned for my next video, man. I'm out of here. Peace.